Hello, I'm John Klusnick, President of Bonapro, and today we're going to go over your low moisture encapsulation cleaning procedures for a single and two-step method. So whether you're brand new and a beginner or a veteran in the field, I hope you'll get something from this video that helps you take care of your customers, put a smile on their face, and put money in your pocket. Let's get started. It's IICRC standard to pre-vacuum before any type of carpet cleaning. Vacuuming will also remove a layer of soil that will not use up your cleaning solution, making it more effective. Remember, every step done correctly not only makes the next step easier and more efficient, but it also gives you a better end result. Always remember to put out your wet floor signs to ensure safety and prevent accidents. After your end cap cleaner is selected, in this case odorless surround free mixed at 4 ounces per gallon, mix your selected end cap to manufacturer's dilution guidelines using a measuring cup. First, fill your tank with water. This will reduce foaming and then add your measured chemical amount. Select your bonnet and center it under the pad drive. I like to spray in front of the machine so within a second or so I am on moist carpet. This not only starts the cleaning process, the moisture provides lubrication and cooling, protecting the carpet's fibers. A dry bonnet can melt olefin carpet in as little as 8 seconds. But done with correct equipment, chemicals and training, bonnet cleaning is very safe for carpets and beneficial. With any carpet cleaning method, your chemistry does the bulk of the cleaning. Heat and agitation contribute but the chemistry is what separates the soil from the fiber and pulls it into and holds it in the water molecules with the cleaning chemical. If this reaction does not occur, all the heat or agitation in the world will only give you slight improvements. If the soil conditions are very light, you may not have to overlap, but for everything else you want to overlap by 50% as seen in the video. When bonnet cleaning, you need to remember that wet is attracted to dry. This is why you want to use equipment that can spray down the encapsulant. This makes your operation a single step and much faster and more profitable and will improve your results. Your carpets will have a more evenly cleaned appearance and will dry more evenly. The bucket method after the first ringing uses contaminated water and will be very wet in the beginning and drier at the end, making the results less effective and efficient. Your chemicals clean, your bonnets or vacuum in the case of hot water extraction, carry the suspended soil from point A to point B. Your water is holding the chemical.